Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get a mythical fish every single time without fail in Fishing Simulator. So make sure you guys stay tuned, watch the whole video, and make sure you subscribe and leave a like. Before I show you guys this method, which by the way, it's super easy to do. Anybody can do it with any rod. Um, although the best rod that you would want to have is probably... You're probably going to want to try to have like a mythical rod on or at least... A legendary rod um, the rod that I have right now is the Sakura branch one it's or the the cherry blossom one it's probably one of the best it's actually probably the best rod in the game so that's the one that I'm using you guys can use any other ones I know that the where is it if I can see here okay so there's a rod in here that's super good for catching mythicals um, right here the ice queen's scepter this rod is probably the best the second best one because it has a 35% rarity chance so either this one or the blossom rod whichever one you guys want to use it's up to you or even if you don't have any of those and you're just starting you can use like a basic rod or you know maybe a legendary or uncommon rod anyway so to, before we do this i also wanted to just check out the update i haven't played this game in like four years so i just wanted to check out the update and see like everything that's changed apparently there's so much that's changed including vaults which is basically i think it's a guy that you talk to on the on port jackson anyway the vault is somewhere on this island but basically it's really cool you can store fish or sharks or pretty much you can store pretty much anything and it'll lock in that way like no one ever no one can get it but it doesn't have to be in your inventory either anyway that's also a really cool update that came out the other really cool update is first of all for me at least they updated port jackson it looks way different than it used to um and they added a second c so they added if you look on the map you can see that there's like the smugglers bay need hogs beach and there's like a there's like a whole second area that you can teleport to like if you complete a bunch of quests and everything like that so all right we're gonna show you guys i'm gonna show you guys how to do how to find a mythic fish um every single time so first things first if you have it if you don't that's totally okay i like to use the fish master so i can see like which which spots in the ocean have like really good fish and it looks like right here has really good fish so we're just gonna take out our rod all you're gonna do is they kind of change this a little bit for the update but i found a way around it so you just put in your little rod and then you just scroll scroll out a little bit so that you can see what kind of fish you're getting now the important thing for this is to make sure you know what kind of fish you're looking for that right there i know that's a mythical sunfish and boom there we go we got ourselves a mythic sunfish I try to like position yourself in a place where you know that your rod is gonna like go in this direction and then you just look underwater you can see what kind of fish goes on your hook if it's the fish that you want like if it's a mythical let's go over here this also works for like any type of fish variation so let's say that you're trying to get like quest and you're trying to let's say that you're trying to do a quest and you want to and you're only supposed to get like a certain type of fish you can also do this method it's gonna sit here and wait and you can see here oh that one came on the hook really quick okay I think this is a mythical right here I don't know. I haven't actually played this. Oh, in a while. Oh, there we go. Giant sea bass. Still really good. I haven't played this game in a while, so I'm not sure what all the mythicals are. So that's going to be the trick is just making sure you know what fish look like what. Like which, which fish are mythicals and which ones aren't. Uh, let's go ahead and just try it somewhere else. There's only one place that this doesn't really work on, but I think we might be able to give it a shot. I'm going to try it. But the only place, any place with lava, basically, sometimes I'm pretty sure it doesn't work on there because just because like the lava, I mean, you can't really see through lava. So, but that said, I'm going to give it a try anyway, because, you know, why not? Let's, let's try guys. But basically guys, this method works in any location except for maybe lava, but we're about to test that theory, but it works almost everywhere. So you guys feel free to use it. Um, it's, it's super good super helpful you can see what kind of fishes you're getting it saves you some time too so you don't have to spend all your time like trying to get you know a bunch of uncommon fish when all you need is just one um oh i think it does it does work okay so for lava it also works for lava too so any location that does have lava you literally just look in and you can see what kind of fish is going to show up on your hook this works the same for like neon fish or mythical fish i have other videos on it if you guys want to see i have other videos that explain like how to do stuff like this but yeah that's basically it for this video thank you guys so much for watching it's been a pleasure i hope you guys have a great rest of your day bye